Question number 11, 2014, paper 2, mathematics. We are told to solve the simultaneous equations. Uh, 3x minus uh, y is equals to 9. And then we have uh, x squared minus xy is equals to 4. Now, because of the nature of the second equation, which is uh, has x squared, it is not possible, it is uh, difficult to use the elimination method. Uh, so we use substitution method. Uh, so where we have 3x minus y, we take y to the other side, it becomes positive, so y, and we take 9 to the left hand side, it becomes minus, so y is equals to 3x, uh, 3x uh, minus uh, 9. Uh, so with that we can substitute we can uh, substitute y in the second equation so we have x squared minus x now instead of y we put uh, 3x minus 9 that uh, takes care of y so this is equals to 4 where we open the bracket this will be x squared minus this will be 3x squared and then we have my uh, this will be plus 9x because the minus and minus becomes positive uh, we bring 4 to this side uh, we will have uh, minus 4 uh, is equals to 0 so a uh, minus uh, minus x squared minus 3 x that will give us minus 2 x squared then we have uh, plus 9 uh, minus 4 is equals to zero we can take everything to the right hand side or multiply by minus one uh, so let's say we take to the left of the to the to the left hand to the right hand side we have two x squared uh, uh nine becomes minus this is supposed to be minus uh, plus nine x so that is minus nine x uh, 4 becomes positive is equals to 0. Now, this is a familiar equation. It is a quadratic equation uh, which we can solve. If you are okay solving quadratic equations, you just write the factors. But uh, because we are revising, uh, let, just, let me just go through the whole process of solving a quadratic equation. So, we write, get two numbers. We multiply 2, multiply by 4, that will give you 8. Get two numbers which uh, when you multiply you get um, 8 and when you add you get minus 9. That is, uh, we can take uh, minus 8 and minus 1. So, we can rewrite our equation as 2x squared minus 8x uh, minus x. That's the same as 9x uh, plus 4 is equals to 0. Uh, now we can factor out that and we have uh, we factor out to x uh, we will be left with the x minus 4 and uh, again here we factor minus 1 we will be left with x minus 4 what is inside the bracket should be the same so that we are able to factor it so factor x minus 4 I will be left with the 2x uh, 2x minus 1 is equals to uh, 0. Uh, so simply we can say x is equals to f uh, 4 or uh, x is minus a half. So those are the values. So that's how we solve a quadratic equation. Uh, once you do that, so we can get now, since we already have our y, when x is equals to 4, we can say f y is equals to 3 times 4, that is 12, 12 minus 9, uh, it will give you 3. So we are substituting in this equation here. Uh, when x is equal to a half, we say y is equal to 3 multiplied by a half, that will give you 1.5. 1.5 minus 9, it will give you minus 7.5. Uh, so that is... Uh, uh, that is how you solve that equation. So the value of x when uh, well the value of y when x is 4 is 3 and the value of y when x is a half is minus 7.5. So that's how you do that. But you don't have when during the exam if you are comfortable solving a quadratic equation you can get uh, the factors directly here. Uh, there is no problem you know to be penalized. That will help you save time.